Hello, my name is Sean Hughes. I'm a graduate student from the National University of Ireland, Maynooth, and I presented my uh, research at the 23rd APS Annual Convention in Washington, D.C. Um, one of my research interests are in the teaching of psychology, and in particular those factors that are help or hinder student learning. And one factor that may hinder student learning are misconceptions, that is, that inaccurate or incomplete knowledge that students bring to their studies that are inconsistent with the core concepts of our discipline. So examples include um, people only use 10% of their brain, um, human memories like a video camera, um, people with schizophrenia have multiple personalities, um, and people believe these things despite a lack of any evidence to support these claims. One of the challenges of these claims for psychologists is, well, and particularly the teaching of psychology, is that um, they're widespread in addition to being highly resistant to elimination. So one of the ideas we wanted to explore were would graduate students, like their undergraduate counterparts, um, fall prey to these weird ways of thinking about psychology. So we sampled 550 graduate students, um, psychology students from over 20 institutions um, throughout America, and we asked them to complete this online self-paced questionnaire. So what did we find? Um, well, we found that graduate students really do think straight about weird things. That is, um, they correctly identified over two-thirds of the misconceptions. But that said, they fell prey to 25% of these erroneous false ideas. And we also found that graduate students um, with more disciplinary training, so for example those approaching the end of their doctoral training, um, were able to ad better identify and reject more misconceptions in comparison to those just starting their graduate training. Um,